mal pera hera min pera hera That was a hell of a journey up to Jaffna and back. I loved every minute of it. Come to Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Streets are buzzing this morning, I'll show you that. Our time in Jaffna had come to an end and there was just enough time to catch a few more glimpses of the beautiful city of Jaffna. Okay, thank you, Nandvan. How much are you gonna tax me? Seven kind of rupees. Hmm? Seven kind of rupees. Seven hundred. So there's no buses directly to Colombo, so we're gonna go to Vaunia and then uh, change there. That's the idea. A lot more seats here. There's an extra extra row on the left there, sort of like a plane configuration. We've got a guy selling wadi. There's a few different things for sale on these buses. Dude was selling uh, water bottles full of black liquid a second ago. Don't know what they were. I should have got one. If he comes back, I'll get one. This guy here is selling something. I can't tell what it is. It's got like a washing up bowl with something in it. I'll give it a shot, let's see what he's got. Oh, he's gone, he's gone. We'll never know, we'll never know. Julia's just gone in this little shop here to get some water. And uh, this is a little look of the town. Let me see if I can find out what the name is. Excuse me, do you know the name of this town? This is Waunia. Waunia. Raunia. Waunia. Waunia. Thank you. What bus are you taking? You're taking the bus to Colombo? Colombo, this is bus Colombo, private. This? Oh, nice, okay. okay. Private bus to Colombo. Thank you. So we ended up jumping off that bus after like two minutes because Julie's hungry and I ate all the biscuits. So we've got a food city here. We're going to get Julie some food and hopefully catch another bus to Colombo. You won't believe it, we made it back to the same bus we just jumped off. Except for now we have crisps, snacks, water, everything. We're set. Eight hardcore hours later, we were sat in the exact same seats with the exact same music playing and the worst ass ache either of us had ever experienced in our lives. It's fair to say it was one of the hardest, longest, most gruelling journeys I'd ever been on. I was extremely grateful for having a seat as some people were literally falling asleep on their feet. The only complaint about this seat is it's directly facing the speaker. Oh my god, what a journey. And uh, where the fuck are we? That was rough, that was rough. Columbo's over there just behind us. There's the bus saying goodbye. It's starting to rain. I noticed it in Jaffna. Hello! <laughs> Somebody on the bus there. I know it's in Jaffna, I don't think it rains much. I think it's extremely dry there. As soon as we come off the bus here, further south, we've got a little bit of rain. Oh wow, there's a tower right there. Looking beautiful today. No energy, I don't blame you. Usually I take my phone, I take the best Instagrammable. So we're on the last leg of the journey now before we reach the hotel. We're in a tuk-tuk. We need to go to um, Sevira Hotel. 
six kilometers away. It's a good tip when you're traveling Sri Lanka, always make sure the tuk-tuk driver has um, a YouTube, YouTube video. Always make sure the tuk-tuk driver has his um, meter, yeah, make sure he has his meter, make sure it's working. A lot of the drivers will tell you that the meter's broken. If that's the case, make sure you know exactly how many kilometers it is to your destination. One kilometer is 100 rupees right now in two, 2023. Don't get robbed. Oh, nice. Nice and big. Look up. Let's come and treat ourselves to a nice, well deserved bucket of KFC tonight. And uh, that's about it. The next morning. Morning, YouTube. Back in Colombo today. We're going to start today. The Sri Lankan way, we're going for a tambili, aka a king coconut, and then we're going to one of our favorite breakfast places in Colombo. We didn't put it on the vlog last time, we just went for a cheeky breakfast, not knowing what we we're in for, and it was banging. So we're gonna vlog that. What's the name of the place? Cafe Kumbu. Cafe Kumbu. Check it out. This type of tree is by far my favorite type of tree. I don't know what type of tree it is, but it's absolutely beautiful. They're always huge. They always grow like uh, these vines down from the tree. This doesn't have many. I've seen other ones with just hundreds of these vines coming down everywhere. And then if you look at the stem, it's like nothing, the trunk or whatever you want to call it. It's like nothing you've ever seen. It's just uh, a web of like vine slash root. I don't know what it is and it comes down and look what it's doing to the ground as well. It's actually digging into the tarmac here. There's two trees, same species, right next to each other here. I bet that one is a seed from that one. And uh, look at it, it's just so cool. So cool. Hit me in the comments if someone can tell me the name of this tree. Let's see, look, someone's tied that in a knot. And I'm hoping the uh, King Coconut stands up here, but I have a feeling it might be closed. I don't know why. No coconuts, eh? So, uh, I'll go that way. Can I get it? I got a meter. You got a meter? Yeah, yeah. How much is one kilometer? 100. 100, yeah. perfect. Okay, let's go. I like that you say 100. You know, normally, because I'm with, with tourists, we get very high prices. Yes, yeah, I I respect that. Honda Cola. Uh -huh. There we go, we're in the tuk tuk. We're off to the breakfast spot. So here we are at the Anna Cafe. You having a granola bowl? Straight away when you come in, you can see it has a, a lovely um, Goa vibe to it. South Indian vibe. Everything I do, everything I see, girl, reminds me you and me. Holding on, walking on, the sand and nobody, just you and me. And when that time's begun... I'd like to order the granola bowl. Uh, can I request no pineapple? I don't know what fruit. We don't have pineapple. Okay. Is it possible to have more mango and no banana? Just check if it's possible. Yeah, okay. If not, if not, just. I get a breakfast burrito. So we went for the mint and passion iced tea. Next, we ordered the island chiller. There we go. There's the breakfast burrito. Looking good. That. I used to make something Basic. similar to that. They took care of my special request, so I asked for no banana and more mango instead. And That's what you got? Yeah. That does look good, that. It's amazing. The waiter was kind enough to offer us a complimentary dessert, because we've been here twice, I imagine. I'm not sure what it is, it looks like some kind of cheesecake. It looks really good. And give this a try. It's a cheesecake and it's um, like lemon fresh. Mm. It's really good. 
Excuse me, miss. Excuse me. Do you know the name of this? What's the name? Hairline pie. Hairline pie. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. K-line pie, there you go. That was an absolutely banging breakfast. Highly recommend this place if you're in Colombo. Right, on to the next. We're gonna go and find the train um, and head back towards Ben Tolton now. We're gonna recoup, get some fresh clothes in our bag, and I think we're gonna go out and travel to Ankara a bit more. Stay tuned for the next nice episodes. Thank, thank, you. You. thank you. You have a nice day too. Thank you, thank you. We've got one hour until the next train to Bentota, so we, we decided to come check out this little market. Julie's in her element, as usual. I almost lost her already. What's that? What are you looking at there, Julie? What it? I do love these kind of markets. You just, you never know what you're gonna find. You could literally find anything around here. Let's see what we've got. Phone cases, magazines, toys, shirts, shorts anything if you need it it's right here in colombo there's more market on the other side so we're going to cross this bridge it's going to take us across that busy road and we'll also be on the right side ah i love it i think it's cute it's no i don't like it it says you it looks like Does it you're suit a fisherman me? yeah no no not no fisherman cap fisherman cap like well, that well i'm a fisherman so we want a fisherman cap fisherman cap like that I, 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 let's see the fisherman cap Oh my god, that's like the adventure yeah, Oh uh, nah, it's too old fashioned that. I look like, uh, you know, I'm only 30. Well, and it's too small for my head as well. But nah, I think, what do, what do you, you think you about the head? You got the head. Oh, yeah, that's I quite the like the pink one. That's the yeah. What do you think about this, really? Might get yeah. it. Is it comfortable? Yeah, it's nice. Does it look good? Nah, yeah. it's okay, I like this one. You don't want the Rasta right? Nah, it's All a right. secret, I'm a secret Rasta. Okay then. Really? What's your rate? Should I get this? What do you think, YouTube? Should Is I it... cop this hat? I like the colour. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he said nice. He said uh, nice. Thousand eight hundred. Thousand eight hundred. I give you one thousand for it. One thousand. Oh no. No, can't do it. You want to look in the mirror before you? Nah, it's okay. I'll take it for a thousand. No more. No. Ah, it's okay. Don't worry. Like, Last price is 1000. Yeah. Hello. Harry? Okay, I'll do one. I think you should look at the mirror. Right. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna give it a Thank you though. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Why? I don't know. We're on the bridge now. This might give us a nice view of Colombo. Let's see. I love the skyscrapers out here. That one's still in construction. It's mad. Even in a developing country with so where the people have so little money, there's still big, major, million dollar projects going on all over the place. It's interesting to see the contrast. This lady's got none of it, you know, and it's all locked in these buildings there. All the money's up there. That is called like, I think it's called the Colombo Tulip or something like that. You can actually go to the top, but it's like a tenner. I thought, fuck that, because I'm a stingy cunt. I worked hard for my cash, you know. Yeah. So here's the other half of the market. Everything from nuts to bags to suitcases. Great place to get pickpocketed, I tell you. You can feel it. Some pickpockets hanging around here. Only look. No, I'm okay, thank you. Nice little slipper shop. They're nice, Adidas sliders there. Decent. Yeah, they're good. Basically, all a mall is, is uh, a market at the end of the day it's just more organized and put into brick but the origins of the mall will lie have its roots in places just like this very good thank you how are you good oh very nice hey dude how are you doing today yeah good 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 what are you doing today? You working on this market? You working? Add the weather? 
Ah, the weather? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, it's working, yeah. Alibaba. Alibaba. Kiede? Yeah. Can I kiede? It does have a CI. It does have a CI. 1800. Yeah. Hello, my friend. Hello, Yalua. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Is this your shop? Oh, my God. Nice, nice. Are you from Colombo? Yes, of course. Nice, nice. How's life in Colombo? I think I'm going to go to the end of the There you have it. Now you know what life in Colombo is like, you know? <laughs> hello, hello. hello. Say like and subscribe. Say like and subscribe. <laughs> like? Subscribe. No, I don't know. He's our boss. Hey, boss man, come on, give me a like and subscribe. This <laughs> <laughs> little shy. Little shy. Bye, bye, bye. Okay, bye, bye, bye. Ledger, ledger. Oh, oh. Hello, it's very hot here. Where can I buy henna? You know, henna? Henna. This stuff. Henna. Singala nama? Henna? English henna? Singala? How do you say? Henna? Singala nama? Yeah, how do you say henna in Singalese? Singala nama? You don't know? How like that? Yeah, nice. Nice t-shirt. You should hold it up and say visit Sri Lanka. In fact, we'll get the local to do it, it'll be even better. Can you say for the YouTube video, say visit Sri Lanka. Tell people to come Sri Lanka. Understand, no? Yeah. Done there? I understand. Yeah. understand. You want to do it? Go. You want this? You want this? Action. You want this? No, no, I don't want it. Say visit Sri Lanka. Ah, yeah, yeah. I'm, 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 Oh, yeah, yeah. YouTube, that's right. Two, one. <laughs> like and subscribe. Three, two, one. <laughs> Say like and subscribe. Hey! Say visit Sri Lanka. Yeah, yeah. Come to Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Nice, nice. Thank you. <laughs> no chance. We decided we're going to treat ourselves to date. We're going to try and go first class, but it's often fully booked. But for that bit of aircon, I don't care. I'm going to pay it. Did you have that? No, I never had it's it. It's disgusting, but we used to only have these. I think they were the cheapest one we could have. So I want to give a shout out to this little cafe here at Colombo Station. It looks sketchy as fuck, but it's actually really good. All the food's fresh and good. It's good tasty. You know, you got all your local little snacks here. I think we have a very good turnover. That's what's good about it. But we're just after a couple of Cokes for the ride today. Coca-Cola's. Too small. Oh, we don't have a small. Yeah, in fact, one small and yeah, yeah, no, 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 I'm sorry, too small, too small. <laughs> yeah, I want water. To switch it up a bit, we decided to explore everything that the first class experience has to offer. Let's have a look. Look at that, people going crazy trying to get a seat, I guess. <laughs> Did you see that? It was like a rugby scrum. I've lost my jewelry. So in the madness, I lost jewelry and um, I tried looking for her and I couldn't find her. And then I said, you know what? What, you followed me? You followed me here? No, I was looking at the door like outside and oh, I really? saw the crowd and I was like, oh my God. Yeah, well, I lost Quite her, I found her, we made it. So first of all, you gotta know that it has actual closed doors at each end of the carriage, which means the air conditioning stays in. It's very cool in here, it's a nice temperature. Um, it's spacious, it's more clean, and you've got uh, nicer, newer seats, obviously. You've got a little tray table to have your dinner, almost like an airplane. 
and then uh, you got this thing I don't know what the real function of it is but you know we paid for it so we're gonna use it there you go oh, it's for your feet in it Julie already found hers we have that in the UK what are you talking about really what's it for it's not any more comfortable than putting your feet on the ground it's like what yes it is how is it let's see what the seats do Oh, there's a little light on the chair. You can charge your phone. Oh, it's got a little phone charger. Nice. Of course, you still got that amazing sea view, just with the luxuries of aircon. When you've been on the trains a bit, you know, you start to want to not sweat for a minute and go first class. It's only, it cost us 1,000 for two, so two pound 50 for two first class tickets. So. All right, guys, I'll see you back in Bentota. back at Ventota where we started that was a hell of a journey up to Jaffna and back I loved every minute of it anyway so there you have it first class versus second class little look around the markets and whatever else we did this morning oh we had that peng breakfast all right I'm gonna call that an episode now thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one peace Mal pera hera men pera hera ntezi Atazi ve 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 ntezi Wow look at that Look at that I'm glad we weren't there That's third class Wow look at third class they've just rammed it like that I wonder how much it costs to go third Bentota Beach.